This first movement, harmonizing yin and yang. We're gonna take and we're gonna form a ball. You're gonna take your left hand and put your right hand over the top. I'm mirroring, so I'm saying left, right. That means that you're using your left and we're using our opposite of that. All right? All right. So, one hand's on top, the other hand's on bottom. Got it. We got this imaginary ball of energy between the palms. Now we're gonna take and smush the ball down a little bit, make it a little smaller, and then we're gonna separate the ball. So the left hand is up, the right hand is down, and we got this space under the arm. So you're spreading the body out as if you're trying to touch the walls to either side of you. Now we're gonna take and make this big ball and turn it into a smaller ball. And then we're gonna separate the ball. Right hand is up, left hand is down. Harmonizing yin and yang. Big ball, smaller ball, separate the ball. Beautiful. Again, big ball, small ball, separate the ball. Now what do we do with the breath? We inhale the big ball. Exhale, smaller ball, and continue to exhale, separating the ball. Now we inhale, big ball. Exhale, smaller ball. Continue to exhale, separate the ball. Inhale, big ball. Exhale, smaller ball. You're following this, right? I'm following you, very too. Continue to exhale, separate the ball. Beautiful. Now, we've just harmonized yin and yang, right? Yes, we so did. So now we're going to take this ball, and we're going to form the ball again, and bring your left foot in to your right heel. Cool. Now, we're gonna take a pause and we'll add another element. What did we just do, Henderson? We just did harmonizing yin and yang. Harmonizing yin harmonizing and yang. Harmonizing yin and yang. If you cannot feel ball, that, I don't know what I'm gonna tell you. Yeah. Join us on part three, yeah. coming up. <laughs> <laughs>